Now to the latest on the coronavirus. San Diego County is moving towards the purple tier of the state's reopening plan. If things do not improve in the next week, the county will be forced to close near, nearly all of its non-essential indoor businesses starting next week. Our ABC 10 reporter Laura Acevedo joins us on the story. So Laura, what is pushing us towards this purple tier? Well, Steve, county officials say that it isn't one specific outbreak that is causing these high numbers. Instead, people that are letting their guard down, like not wearing their masks and not avoiding large gatherings as per the county health order. Now, right now, we are technically still in the red tier, but our numbers have increased so much that we are uh, in the purple tier when it comes to our numbers. Now, our unadjusted case rate for the week increased to 8.7, and the adjusted rate to 7.4. Now to stay in the red tier, we'd have to be below seven. So you can see both of those rates are higher than what is required. Now the county says it is doing everything it can to stay out of the purple tier, like increase the testing and adding new testing sites, but they say they can only do so much if people don't follow the health guidelines. Now, County Supervisor Nathan Fletcher says that the increase in cases just caught up with us. We'll have to wait until next week to see what our numbers are next week, uh, but it would take a significant change in trajectory uh, given everything that we've been witnessing over the course uh, of the last month uh, in order for us to avoid that. Now, county officials were warning that this could happen for weeks now. A reminder that moving into the purple tier would mean that many businesses that are operating indoors right now would have to move back outdoors. This includes things like restaurants, places of worship and gyms. Also, retail would have to reduce their indoor capacity to 25 percent. Reporting live, Laura Acevedo, ABC 10 News.